Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. I wish I could ask you on a date. Is it really that difficult? You would understand if you tried. <sighs> hey, Tails, would you have a date with me? Sure. It was not that difficult. It's all right. Trust me, you're more attractive than her. And you have this. My heart? Your tits. He's in good hands, Sally. I'm sure everything is just fine. Your boo friend is not fine. So you and Knuckles really are a thing now, huh? Listen up, pretty girl. Knuckles is like a brother to me. If you break his heart, I swear to chaos I'll chase after you, find you, and send you straight to hell with my hammer, understood? Uh-huh. I'm so happy for you. Knuckles, we... Yeah. Talked about this. Get off me, woman! Ain't no one touching me! Nothing like a little sleep to calm the nerves. Hmm, handy. Got any more? Tails, why can't you see how amazing you are? Open your eyes, Tails. I... I love... to cream Get them go! Uh... Huh, honey, you okay? You've been arguing since my arrival? Oh, really? In your dimension, you're enemies or something. What? Of course not. To be my enemy. One has to be at least some kind of danger. Haha! <laughs> I like this one! So why are we here again? We're following Tails and Cosmo to ensure their date goes smoothly. Okay, well why am I here? You're our getaway car! Hey, Blaze! Ready for a dinner date? I command you to stay right there. It's all right, Blaze. We can try again later. Blaze! There you are! Hey, Blaze! What you doing? I was running around the Kingdom BTW. Where were you? It's not like I was searching for you, of course. I was just doing some exercise. You should try it, too. I... I'm not trying to say that you need it. I think you have a really good shape. I mean, you can do it if you want, hey! Shut up and date me. I need to face Metal Sonic on my own place. He knows what I know. And leave.
save me sitting here worrying my tail off while you play hero. Yes, you and my friends are more important than me by a long shot. Fine then. Fine. Be careful. Be safe. I will. Good. Good. Good luck on the race, because you will only see my back. Is that a punishment or a reward? Sunshine, this is so soft. What's this made out of? Chest fur! Boy, what a day! Now that I'm in bed, I can finally... Can we not fight and just get along? Violence is never the answer. Pfft, that's nonsense. Yeah, violence is always the answer. Wanna fight me just for the fun of it? You bet I do! Tails! Tails, are you okay? Would you like a hug? Hey Tails! I think she likes you! Go on! Make a move! The last time they saw one another, Cream had been a lot younger and smaller. Are you okay, Percival? I... Save the hugs and kisses for later. Aye! Ah! Ahem. Such a knave. Um, sure is a pretty view. Huh? Yeah, the islands do look pretty from up here. Actually, I was talking about you. Ah, oh, Sonic, thank you. You know, I don't think we've ever kissed in super form. Hey, pick up the slack, you too. We have somewhere pressing to be. Oh, I think Amy too's jealous. Who do you think you're talking to, Hedgehog? There they go again. I can do most anything. Can you make a pie? No. Neither can I. Here. I know it's not much, but... Huh? I want you to have this. Here. Huh? Take this. Thank you. I beat me a long time no see. What? Mini-me, do you remember when I told you that your future will be great? Yes. Well, mine won't. They're gonna replace me with a taller guy with a scarf and bandages and messy hair. They replaced me with a hipster. It's okay, Big Me. You just gotta accept it. Like I f***ing accepted you. Just give me the stupid gem. No way! I found it, so it's mine! Sharing is caring. Who says I care? Oh. Ha! Can't get it now, can ya? 
You're a terrible kisser. Tickle, I can explain. You mean, you get to appear in the next movie, even though I came before you. He gets to appear next, but I'm an important classic character. You guys get to appear? You three short wheat drinks can't stop me. Honestly, my shadow would never go outside looking like a wild bush hog fresh out of some ditch. Your quills are so dirty, mister, do you live in a cave or something? And what's with that little toupee on your chest? Grow it out! Ah, release me, woman! Huh? What's up, Blaze? Hmm? What is it? Did your tail want something? I... I'm sorry. My tail was hard to control just now. Huh? Just now? Ah! You're wrong! I don't have any hidden motives! Sonic! Uh, my Amy, please help! Of course, my Sonic. What do you need help with? Haha, <laughs> no way, this is cute. Is it okay if I leave while everyone is distracted? You'd look even more cute if you smile. Really? There we go, our, our first kiss. Wow. Can we do that again? Oh, oh, sh sure. One city destructive battle later. You inspire my inner serial killer. Add a fire, baby. Sure. Time, Tails. Oh, thanks, Cosmo. That smells delicious. Mm, this is so good. What's in here? It's what's known as passion flower tea. It's for when those need a lot of sleep, cause even when they slept, they still haven't enough energy to get through there. Oh, oh, I apologize. I was rambling, wasn't I? Yeah, but you can keep going. I actually like the rambling, it's cute! Am I made out of atoms? Yes, everything is. Are shadows? Are dreams? Okay, I think that is a bit too complicated for you to understand right now. So you don't think you can teach it to me, Mr. Eggman? Of course I could! I am the greatest scientific genius in the world! And just to prove it, I will now. <laughs> 
So starting with shadows assuming you aren't talking about a certain artificial hedgehog my grandfather created are not actually something they are more so the absence of light, or to be more precise, to separate it from the concept of darkness itself, which is the absence of light caused by something blocking the light. Dreams are a bit more complicated for one when I said everything is made out of atoms. This was a massive simplification for the sake of your six-year-old mind, but atoms themselves are also made of something, and everything can at the end be traced back to energy. As for dreams in particular, after my grandfather Gerald Robotnik made the discovery of the soul, which disproved the prior theory that dreams come just from a combination of chemical and electrical processes in your brain, and revealed that additionally to these processes, the soul also has an influence. This was obviously only believed until I, the great Dr. Eggman, discovered the plane of imaginary world, and discovered as our bodies and souls' ability to dream is directly linked to the precious stone that was created for this very reason by the goddess of dreams Illumina, when she created dreams to give the prior creation of a soul a meaning as well as to enrich her ethereal plane of imaginary world through the dreams of other beings. So does this answer all of your questions? All but one. And which is the one still standing? How can someone so smart like you be so cruel and evil? I think it's time for you to go back home, Cream. Once there was an ugly badnik. He was so ugly that everyone died. The end. The moral of this story is inscrutable and not particularly helpful. Disagreed. It is good that they died. Teleporting is superior to portal creation because it's faster and requires less effort. At least when I step through a portal, I know I'll come out the same person, not a shitty replica of rearranged atoms. If you can't tell the difference between the replica and the original, then why should it matter? Cream, could you tell me bedtime story, please? Okay, there once was a long-eared rabbit who really liked this two-tailed fox, and the rabbit adored this fox with all her heart. Wait, these characters sound familiar. I love you, Mr. Tails, with all my heart. Can't you ever use your brain? I'm trying, but my brain can only think about you. Long time no see. Amy! How are you doing? I'm good. You? Same. Wait. Sonic, are you? Jealous? Humph, <laughs> no way! You know what, Amy? You're right, I'm totally flirting with you. Let's go to the chase where you let me motorboat those knockers. Also, I got some chain and a whip back at the Zeppelin if you're into that kind of thing. Oh, Sonic, Jet just admitted he's flirting with me. You jealous? Not really. But, but he also said something about motorboating my knockers. Whatever that means. Jealous now? If someone tries to touch you in a place that makes you feel uncomfortable, that's no good. Wow. Thank you for bringing me to see the Master Emerald Sonic. The last time I was on Angel Island, I was a Zombot and I couldn't appreciate it.
No problem! Yeah, thank you, Sonic. Come on, Knuckles! Tangle has already proven many times that she is reliable! Can I touch it? No. Sonic, I made this for you. It's filled with my love, so be sure to eat it all. Uh, actually... Just remembered I gotta... Ark! Gratefully accept this. Yay! And don't forget about White Day, okay? I know you like her. I don't like Rouge! I didn't say who. Oh boy? No problem, they don't call me Fix-It Fox for nothing. Well, nobody calls me that actually, but I'm hoping it'll catch on. Whoa, what happened here? This looks like a job for Fix It Fox. <gasps> and there, all done, Sonic. Uh, Amy, why'd you cut my quills shorter than usual? just felt like doing something different, that's all. This reminds me of how I used to style my quills when I was younger. My fans are gonna love this. Oh, why not? It's not like I could seriously break it. Actually, Tangle the Master Emerald has broken like twice in the past. Oh, really? How did it break? The first time it broke is when Chaos was released. And the second time. I changed my mind. You can touch it. Yeah? We know you broke it to protect it. There's nothing to be ashamed of. Shut up, Sonic. Should we break up? Why should we? A lot of people don't really like us being together. They want me to be with Amy and you with Shadow or Knuckles. I'd know about that, but hey, that's just their personal preferences, I guess. But there's no need to follow it. We can decide for ourselves. So you're saying we don't need to break up? Exactly. I love you a lot. Looks like I won the bet, which means you have to call your crush. <laughs> Hold on, Rouge. Someone's calling me. Hey! Came to the realization he likes her back and is super chill about it. Doesn't realize he likes her back and is super confused by the sudden affection. My book bad blaze. You adorable idiot. Amy, Amy no, no 
swiping. Amy, Amy no swiping. Oh man. Oh no, my first shed. Amy, get me some clothes. Wait, I thought you were always naked. I'm naked for real now. Get me some clothes. Amy, dear, I'm a bit concerned about how high that skirt of yours is. Aren't you worried about others seeing underneath it? Oh, Rouge had the same worries as well. But she came up with a really great idea on how to make sure no one could see much under my skirt. You can't trust those boys. She gave me a pair of her yoga shorts to always wear underneath. I'll have to thank Rouge for that. Sonic, hold my hammer for a minute. Oh, okay. Uh, Blaze, what are you doing? Have I ever told you that I love a man in uniform? Please notice me, Senpai. S senpai. S senpai! I noticed you. Senpai. Ah, uh, look at those two. They are so cute together, don't you agree, Shadow? What the f*** is that fat ass doing with Maria? Been working out lately? You're looking quite buff. Aw, oh, thanks. Did someone say buff? Two tickets for the Barbie movie, please. Oh, in front row seats. He's really excited for this movie. Shut up. Oh, you're adorable. Grr. Uh, is something wrong, little one? I want you to put me down right now. <laughs>